They are the New Mexico United soccer team's most dedicated fans, and they're now cutting ties with the local brewery where they host their team watch parties. News 13's Rachel Knapp is here with more. Rachel. Dean, it all started on social media when the owner of Star Brothers Brewery posted a message criticizing the governor over the public health order. And when comments on the post started to get ugly, that's when the curse severed ties with the brewery. After Governor Michelle Lujan Grisham announced she's stopping all dine in services at restaurants and breweries because of a spike in COVID 19 cases, the owner of Star Brothers Brewing Company in Albuquerque lashed out on his personal Facebook page. The post has since been deleted, but a screenshot was sent to News 13. It says in short, businesses are subject to a tyrannical governor who has declared war on the hospitality industry. John Starr goes on to encourage all restaurants to stop paying vendors, bills, or state taxes. The post sparked fierce debate on social media with people going back and forth with Starr and his wife. That did not go over well with New Mexico United's strongest fan base, The Curse. When United has an away game, The Curse hosts watch parties at the brewery. After seeing the posts, The Curse announced they are cutting ties with the brewery. They say while they're sympathetic to the brewery's struggles, these comments have made some Curse members uneasy, and they're not comfortable encouraging their members to do business at the brewery because of it. The post that John Starr posted, um, I felt was not necessarily appropriate, but I felt his pain. The curse's decision has left United fans split. I just hope that um, there's some reconsideration made to the Starr decision. I feel like maybe it was a knee-jerk reaction with the political climate right now. We were both very relieved that they want to step away from that. Like, our kind of slogan is, Somos Unidos, like, we need to be united. The curse emphasizes it's not about the post being political. It was just how tense the exchange got on social media. Both the curse and Star Brothers declined an on-camera interview. Dean, back to you. All right, Rachel, thank you. Now you can read the full response from the curse and Star Brothers Brewing. Just go to krqe.com.